overall what we're going to see is a continuing trend of consolidation. So healthcare organizations partnering together in a very strategic way because they're at risk wholly for the cost and care of the patient. I expect to see information technology really trying to take a crack at both cost and, and quality. So having healthcare technology that's specifically designed for efficiency and able to take costs out of the system, I think is something that's very important. Really, I think as sort of uh, 5G rolls out for virtual reality, that's going to be really good, and also augmented reality. The patient is going to be at the center of healthcare technology universe. And everybody, providers, payers, pharma, healthcare retailers, they're going to use data from each other and create that patient journey. Yeah, I don't think healthcare technology is going to be evolutionary. I think what we're going to see is a revolution. And it's being driven by consumer expectations. And consumers are expecting uh, to take ownership of their healthcare data, to use applications and digital health services that empower them. And I think that evolution from the consumer perspective will drive uh, the change on the infrastructure and the IT side. I'm most excited about the, uh, the evolution of telehealth and adoption of non-in-person uh, technologies to deliver healthcare. Um, I think that's going to be adopted by primary care and, and other um, specialty care physician groups. I think we're seeing the shift of the Ds. It started with the device. We're all familiar with, with the, the dust collectors that we have in our bedroom now, uh, such as a, a, an activity tracker or a watch. That was the first element, that was the first D. And now we're moving from that D into data. But data is transitioning into the third, which is decision. And that's the linchpin of success. For more videos like this, subscribe to our channel.